the garden. This is uh, kind of where I spend most of my free time, just planting stuff in the garden and trying to plant enough for myself um, to give to people and hopefully to preserve enough for the whole season until uh, spring comes back around. So uh, as you can see, we've got some quite a bit of stuff growing here. And uh, we're going to be using all the stuff grown down here for um, dehydrating in the solar dehydrator. And so, uh, yeah, just grow as much as we can and everything that we can eat. We'll chuck it in the dehydrator and then we'll be able to eat it when we're on the coast, in the mountains, on the road. All organic growing down here. Basically, a bit of manure mixed with all these plants and uh, my compost from all year. And Things are decomposing super fast. Oh, snake. Wildlife sighting. We're just building or making plans to build a solar dehydrator for dehydrating ourselves uh, some food for the winter time. Uh, we got these plans off the interweb and uh, we're just kind of customizing them and making them our own and then uh, kind of salvaged as many materials as we possibly can. And then uh, we bought one sheet of plywood and uh, that should be enough to build the whole thing, hopefully. How's this thing looking? Well, it's, it's coming along, you know. Got the glass on there, the wheels. Got all the uh, compartment done for all the rack, drying racks. Now we're just gonna put some legs on it, turn this thing into a wheeling dehydrator. Fruit trees are starting to pump, and uh, it's great now. But in a couple months, we're going to be thinking, "Man, I wish we had some of that goods right now." So, load up the dehydrator, preserve them for the winter time. So when we're out doing camping trips and hiking missions, we can with boat, nice snacks and sessions. Mm -hmm. 